I don't know if this is the same for anybody else, but for a long time, I would always lay in my bed, you know, trying to go to sleep. And then I would start thinking and I would start thinking ideas, plans, thoughts about what I was going to do with my life, just ideas in general, like tomorrow, my life's going to change completely. I'm going to be a different person in this way. I would think this, this, and this, I'm going to do this, this, and this. I'm going to start going to the gym, work out consistently, eat healthy. I'm going to cut out all the bad things in my life. And I'd be completely ready to change my life the next day. Great ideas. And then I wake up in the morning and then I do the exact same thing that I'd done the day before laying in bed right before going to sleep years from years. I've had so many great ideas and great plans and a lot of which I've pretty much all implemented already now. But back then they're just ideas and not a reality. For years, I wanted to start working out before I actually went to the gym. For years, I wanted to start this YouTube channel before I actually started this YouTube channel. And if I wouldn't have taken action, those ideas, plans, thoughts, they would have been exactly that. Ideas, plans, and thoughts, nothing else, not real. And that is the point here. Ideas without taking action mean nothing. And the reality is for so many people, for most people, they have all these ideas and they don't take any action at all. I mean, think about it. What does it actually mean to have an idea but not take action? You might as well have not even had the idea at all because it's not going to make any difference and nothing's going to get done. Because if you don't take action, whether you've had the idea or not, in the end, nothing's going to happen anyways. Unless unless you take action. The idea on its own, it really doesn't matter at all. It, it can't do anything for you. It's meaningless on its own. But the idea, when you take action and you actually implement it, now it can become reality. Now, a great way to exemplify this is with the game of chess. So think about in the game of chess, the pawn is like your ideas. So pawns are your ideas and the queen, that is execution. That's actually taking action. Now, anybody who plays chess knows that the pawns are the weakest piece on the board and the queen is the strongest, the most powerful piece on the board. The pawn by itself is weak, just like ideas by themselves are weak. But as anybody who plays chess knows, if you get the pawn to the end of the board, the pawn can now become a queen and that queen is execution, taking action. So if you take the pawn and you add execution, action to it, move the piece to the end of the board. Now it's the most powerful piece. That's the difference between an idea, your pawn being the weakest piece on the board versus going to the end of the board and now becoming a reality, becoming the strongest piece on the board. And so the important part, the part that you are missing is that you don't take action. You have the ideas. We all have the ideas, but the only difference between you and the person who has success with those ideas is that they act on them and they actually implement them. They take action and you don't. If you don't realize it by now, you must take action because if you don't take action, you will stay in the exact same spot your entire life. Most people stay in the exact same spot their entire life. Make sure that you're not one of them. And remember, be better than you were yesterday.